Hello, welcome back. Let's just ease back into this gently. So, last time I made a remote door unlocker. I uh, actually got it to work pretty well. Um, there is one small improvement I would like to make to it. I'll do that a little bit later. I talked to Yulian and picked up the mayor spying mission. And I'm going to make that my... Sebastian, open that door from the wrong side. <laughs> I'm going to make that my main mission for now. I'm going to specifically avoid talking to Pixie so that I don't move that part of the story forward. If I talk to Frank... Restrictions and stuff... Help me with something... I already did that... Uh, what did Pixie say Frank might be able to help with? Okay, with what? <laughs> uh... I don't get these computer things. What makes them tick? Good question. I think I have a good book on the subject you could read. I'll bring it tomorrow. I think it ha I have it at home somewhere. Oh, cool. I wonder if that's something that actually happens. Everything cool today? A lot of things to do. Tons of things. Uh, like always? Like always, right. Said something about how you can remove restrictions and stuff. Done that once or twice. Modifier, doors, gadgets, level zero. Oh, hey, Pixie. Uh, limitations. Already went through this. I want to connect to whatever I want. Extra device. Okay. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Anyway, uh, I did this already with the modifier that I found up there. There's just a spare one. Stop it, Sebastian. <laughs> I didn't want you to do that. Wait, what did that say? This is Computer 7. Basic structure for a REPL, or command line interface. Okay, I see. Alright, so that's basically showing me how to do what I did with the remote unlocker, or the networking part of it at least. Uh, something I just noticed. All of the factory data floppies that I put down here have disappeared. Last time I did that mission, that didn't happen. Some of them disappeared, but not all of them did. I kept the important ones to myself, because uh, I wanted to work with them a little bit more. Dude! What's up? Oh, hey. Uh, I'm good. So how's the hacking going? Uh, it's okay, I guess. Sweet, hope Yulian's happy then. Lots of assignments? Some. It's a drag sitting around, rotting away, being on the field. It's okay. <laughs> Let's be non-committal. Oh yeah, he wants me to talk to Elsa, that's right. Uh, who's that? Sebastian hasn't actually met her in this timeline. She's a programmer, not with us. She's independent. Shantytown. I see. Uh, we've met... Uh, say hi from Felix. Okay, sure. Right. So anyway, uh, what I'm going to do is spy on the mayor. His name is George Longson. I checked my list of names and there is actually a George on there. I didn't know his first name before, which is why I couldn't identify him. Uh, I have it noted that I observed someone who might be him coming out of Town Hall at 6.27pm. Uh, Oops, I don't want to talk to Nini right now. So that is the time that I want to be there. i um, trying to think if I have anything else to do, because like it's early-ish in the day. Let me go there now. I'll hang around in that area. Uh, let's see, it's at the plaza. Which way to the plaza? Plaza near cafe, I think. Um, that's boarded up. Can't see what that is. Um, I'll hang around in his area. Uh, I'd like to use the extractor on him. Right, there was. I actually wanted to work with the extractor and improve my remote unlocking capabilities a little bit. Just make it slightly easier to use. I had an idea for a thing to do. Uh, there's Lars. Do I have his name? I do. Good. Uh, where am I? This is not the plaza. I could check the map, but for some reason I don't want to. That's the lion pool. Past the lion pool is... Okay, so there's the cafe. Yeah, okay, that's... Plaza's this way. I think. And that's Doris Gardens.
I should just look at the map. But for some reason, I really want to find my way on my own. I think there's like a lot of buildings in town that I still just have not gone into. I should probably take a day and just do that. Just poke around now that I, I can unlock stuff. Here we go. Here's the place. South of... It was south, right? Isn't that it, though? No, it's... Wait, no. That's Monad's apartment. That's north. Uh, there's a building on each side. What's this one? Is this the place? This is the place. Then what was that one to the east? I'll have to check that. Alright, so guard is here, right? Hold up, you're not allowed through here. Uh, what's this building? City Hall. The mayor runs the city from here. Where's the mayor right now? Mr. Longson? I'm not authorized to tell you. But rest assured, he's busy taking care of very important business. Okay, that's good. Book. City Hall Guard. If I try to go here... Whoa, right. Uh, I'll mess with my extractor in a moment. If I try to go here, she just says, No! <laughs> Doesn't let me go. Alright, so since I know his name, I could check where he is at the police station. There's no harm in that. Let's do that, actually. Um, also, well, yeah, I'll wait until I have some downtime to uh, do the extractor thing. So, police. From here, to get to the police, I want to go across the bridge to the east. To the east? To the east? Uh, and then south. Oh, so somebody pointed out that actually my error with the, um... The hotel computer that I tried to connect to to uh, use it as an unlocker was that I actually just typed in the wrong name, <laughs> um, so I could probably connect to that computer. I don't. It was it was not some weird mystical is this connected to the internet or is it not sort of thing that I thought it was. I just had a typo. That's all, or uh, misremembering. Now the thing is, even if this computer tells me where George is. That might not actually be useful information, in that, um, like, I won't necessarily recognize the name of the building. I needed to modify this, because it, like, disappears ridiculously quick. Alright, so save that. George! Longs in office. Six, negative three. Okay, well, he's in his office. Alright, let me hang out at City Hall. And hope he comes out. Maybe for lunch, because it's just about lunchtime. Whoa, frame rate. So I'm just going to sit in his lobby and do some hacking. There's a door. Every time I see a door like this, I want to go into it, but I have business. Man, that looks super interesting, though. Some kind of crazy tower thing. No, go to Plaza, stay on task. I want to get this mission done. Because as I found out, this is not required for finishing the game, at least if you break it the way that I did. <laughs> I have to see what this is. Alright, so I want... There's Morgan. Here's... who's this? Ah, uh, right, it's that person. Hold on. I want to know who you are. Your name is... Wallenstam. Okay. All right. That's her name. Don't know much about her. She never has much to say to me. But I sure do see her everywhere. All right. So, just going to hope the mayor comes out of here. I'll have a seat. I can extract from the chair? Really? What does that do? Uh. Town hall, sofa seat too. Okay. All right, so I'm going to sit here, pay attention to anybody who comes out of there. But I want to mess with... Um, I don't care about the connections. What I do want to do is um, copy to clipboard name. So that will make it a lot easier to paste that into my coffee if I want to unlock a door. Um, 
So let's make sure that actually works. Uh, in fact, is this door locked? It is. I should not forcibly unlock it, at least not yet. Town hall, door to Longson office. Oh, so he's in there. I'm sitting in the right place. All right. Um, hey, I'll bet I could make my coffee remotely use the missing person finder and report that to me. That would be super useful because, like, in the time that I walked here from there, um, it he he could have left that office. Okay, well, yeah, that's um, that's a thing I should totally do. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, that's fine. Um, so I should have something on my clipboard here. Yeah, town hall door to Longson office. Uh, Computer.unlock. Okay, so let's try this. I believe my typo was... It was actually computer cashier, not counter cashier. It shouldn't hurt to unlock that if I don't go in. I don't trust the... Okay, right, I can just drink it from here. True. Okay. Um, and then I could relock that door. Drink. True. Okay, so that door should be locked again. I can't verify that it was unlocked in that time, but, I mean, everything seemed to work there. All right, cool. Um, so, at the risk of missing the mayor, I, I need to definitely be here at 1827, so in five hours. I want to be sitting in that seat because I saw him come out of this building right around then. Or somebody who might have been him. Uh, so, let's see if I can just make myself a remote missing person finder. Probably going to have to change the, the code in my coffee a little bit just to make this more convenient. Um, I don't think there's anything externally I could really do to... Oh, okay, this is the tower next to the fishing huts. That's where that is. All right. I thought it might have been, but I didn't see the fishing huts when I was looking around before. Those had some moderately interesting stuff in them, but I think it was mostly, like, story things that I wanted to read, not stuff to collect or anything. Uh, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> oh, well... <laughs> uh, there might be other computers that have the the function this one has. All right, so this is missing person finder. Print get position name. Ah, so I'm gonna have to hack in the name from the coffee. I wish I could just like make a little portable computer to take with me, like with a typing interface, and I could call functions on that input. But as far as I know, there's nothing like that. Not that I've found, at least. Alright, so what I need to know is... What is your name? Oh, jeez. I'm glad I didn't copy the clipboard, because I don't want to type all that. Police Office Interior. Ministry Office Workstation Computer 1. This is a ministry... Oh. Okay. It's a ministry thing. George is still in his office. Okay. So, um, I have that in my clipboard, right? Let's just make sure of that before I leave here. That's the key information I needed. Well, you know, I can do this all from here. I'll be able to tell if he goes anywhere. Uh, let's see here. I want to... I'm going to write three functions here, maybe four functions, um, add money to my account, unlock a door, all the things that coffee can do and just, you know, make me less sleepy and stuff. All right, so, um, how do I write just a generic function? I think it's void. Does this use braces? This language does not use braces. No. Let's do some actual programming. Alright, so that's function number one. 
uh, here. This should take a string. So door unlocker. Um, this is just organizational so that I can like comment and uncomment just one thing here rather than having to mess with a big mess of code because there's a lot of stuff I want this coffee to do. Uh, oops. Okay, this has an undo. I don't think I've ever had to undo in this interface before. Alright, and I don't need all of this nonsense anymore. Or this. All that works fine. Okay, so... Um, I'll do that later if I want to hack some money into my account. So this is going to be our... Uh, let's just copy this for speed. And you know what? I don't have that in my clipboard anymore. Uh, do you compile at this point? You do. Uh, open bag. I want you to extract. I right-clicked on you, but you didn't do it. Police office, interior, office, ministry, something, something, uh, coffee. I've used up three of my five hours. No, two of my five hours. All right, I'm just going to assume that pasted successfully, because <laughs> I can't actually see. Uh, say computer dot... Ooh, uh, no, this is actually a little more complicated than this. If I close that, it saves my thing, right? Yeah, this doesn't actually compile. Uh... I think it's get position. Yeah, get position name. So to say uh, computer dot get position name should be fine. Also, I have an error in my unlock function that I will fix. It's not very often that I would need to lock a door, so I'm not going to leave that there. Okay, um, so let's just go ahead and see. Giorgio. Compile this. If I drink that, that should tell me where George is. Yeah, room, Longson office, coordinate negative six, three. Awesome. Okay, so I have a remote person finder now. That's very handy. <laughs> it still amuses me that a cup of coffee is my tool for doing all of these things. <laughs> it's because it's capable of connecting to a server and saying things. Early on in the game, before I understood that different objects have different access to APIs, I was going to make a mystical cube just do everything, because, like, you know, a weird, mysterious, handheld object seems like it may make more sense for this, but turns out cup of coffee, or cup of anything, is the most convenient. So, um, this is the place. Do I have any drugs on me? No, I used them already. However... Can I make my coffee act like drugs? <laughs> Can it do everything, everything? Mm -hmm. So, Longson, you still in there? Yep, he's still in there. Do you have an API for... Let's see, you have sleepiness, drunkenness, drink, corruption, is user... No, you do not have... You don't have quick boost either. That was a thing I did with a baguette. Um... He seems pretty speedy like that. I'm not sure that made me run faster. Have to run a race and measure or something. <laughs> uh, the drug function was called... I don't know what it was called. 
Speed. Change the speed of the drinker. Whoa. Really? Let's try that. I wonder what the base speed is. Whoa, I am way faster. Well, that's cool. Wow, I walk faster too. <laughs> Whoa. I wish I'd discovered this earlier. <laughs> I can be way faster. Uh, I actually kind of want to go back to normal speed because that might be too fast now. <laughs> wow, coffee is powerful stuff. That's still... So I think... That seems even faster than I was. Ten? I don't even know like the, the scale of number that it's, that it's using here. Also, that might just be additive... Is that? Yeah, that's drinking the coffee. So, okay, no, it's it's um, it's not that I'm choosing how fast I am. It's that I'm choosing how much liquid to drink to add speed. <laughs> well, that's super cool. Let's just go ahead and put that in as part of the um, the this. Also, I'll bet you can't add sleepiness. Can I make... Oh, 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 hold on. Hey, George. Huh? Are you George? That's correct. Also known as the strongman of Dorisburg. Strongman. Leader of the pack, so to speak. <laughs> uh, so you're the mayor? None other. Who are you, by the way? So I'm supposed to not make him suspicious. Uh, <laughs> giving a fake name seems suspicious. They call me Seb. For some reason, even though I say my name is Sebastian. <laughs> pleasure, pleasure. All right, let's just extract from him. Whoa, I'm speedy. All right, so I'm just going to tail him. And see where he goes. I'm going to be speedy for a long time because I drank like 120 of those or something. Yeah, I think I'm walking faster than I would normally run. Maybe not quite, but pretty fast. Fast forward, that's the name of the function. The one the drugs do. Is this... this is... I saw you here before, George. I talked to you up there. Yeah, okay. Wait, no, that was Dave. Okay, this is the conversation I eavesdropped on that one time. If you're going to get your d deal, I have my own requirements. How is she, by the way? Oh, here we go. What? Who? The station. Oh, well. <laughs> Haven't had the chance to try yet. But the packaging was promising. What? I really think this kind of production would benefit our city. Yeah, yeah. We have the technology. I guess there aren't any significant problems. So what are we waiting for? Come over to my office and sign this week. Sure, but... Yes. I love this song. I'm in my office. Tell someone to let you through the gate. Good evening. Alright. Don't mind me, I'm just loitering here. Alright, so George wants to go see Dave at the factory. Should I follow Dave? Probably not. Should I talk to George? Probably not. Uh, yeah, probably not. How long do I want to stand here and wait? What an odd place. If I just walk up here, would he notice me? Nope. Use mixer. I don't know how. <laughs> can I hack the mixer? I can. Play theremin sound. But there isn't a button to press. Hmm. Uh, I'll try talking to George. Huh? Uh, oops, I had you confused with someone else. Well, what do you know? <laughs> okay. 
that made him change seats. Hmm. Well, this is not telling me about his love life, just telling me he's... Uh, unless he and Dave are doing something like that. Um, but there was no indication of that either. Well, I'm going to wait here. I'll give it another hour or so and see if he goes anywhere. Someone I feel like I've never seen before just walked by. Also, I'm still super speedy. It's hard to tell from here. I was messing with my credit card. Hacking the credit card is actually kind of interesting. Who is this? And what does he look like? <laughs> oh, that's Fib! Hmm, the gardener. I was supposed to talk to him about hacking stuff. Alright, well that's what Fib looks like. I think I talked to him once long ago. Uh, so while I was waiting for the mayor, I was just poking at objects in my... Wait, where... There's that place. He's still there. Uh, I was just poking at objects in my inventory. Uh, the credit card actually is interesting. I'm surprising... I'm surprised. I never tried to hack this before. Uh, so it has a check balance function that connects to the finance computer and does that. And then it also has a make transaction function that basically... Here he goes. Uh, no, he's just reseating. <laughs> basically shows me how to, uh, hack the finance computer to, um... Oh, get name of card owner, I see. To, uh, add more money to my account so I can easily fill in the coffee function like that if I want to. Um, or I could just put it on the check balance function, because I can poke that, and... Yeah, so that's the purpose of having a... Wait, who's this? I don't know you. Yeah, let's hang out in here and get some people's names. Wow, I'm speedy. <laughs> I keep being surprised by that, even though it's been that way the whole time. So yeah, Emma, Amanda, they were at the party. This person was not. Oh, that's Monad. Whoa. Monad's here. Uh, let's not mess with her. Should I, though? Like, I don't know if to fulfill my requirements I should be hanging back or I should be, like, in there actually talking to people. I'm very wary of talking to people. Uh, but I do want to see what Monad says under these circumstances. I saved a minute ago. Son, I'm trying to enjoy the music. All right. Huh? Oh, never mind. Sorry. <laughs> and now if I click on him... Okay, that still happens. Hmm. Alright, what do Amanda and Emma say? Don't have the energy to talk. Ooh, it's really gone. What? Hampe. What's that? My hamster. Okay, it's, it is, it's Emma who is looking for her hamster. Hamster's name is Hampe. <laughs> sure, will do. Alright then. George is kind of just sitting. Alright, I'll give him another hour or so. Oh, he's moving. I uh, didn't have to wait long at all. I was also looking at the keys in my inventory. Uh, nothing too interesting with them. I looked at the... Oops. <laughs> I looked at the uh, extra key lodge, and once I saw its number, I actually remembered. 9788. I broke into... Oh, he's sitting on the bench. I broke into uh, the lodge once using... What are you doing, George? He's shifting around. Can't get his butt comfortable. <laughs> um... Yeah, I broke into the lodge once, and I remember that code. Uh, I used the brute force unlocker in Frank's bedroom, I think it is, uh, on that door that Felix sits beside. So that's the code for the lodge. Not the most interesting thing, but, you know. <laughs> so hopefully it's not too suspicious if I just stand a few feet away from you and watch your every move. <laughs> I don't think he'll notice. Alright, it's getting close to midnight. I've chosen an angle where I can keep an eye on both George and Monad. They're both moving. Mm, they're going somewhere together. No, they're going somewhere apart. Okay, George goes this way, Monad goes that way. Well, George is my assignment right now, so I'll ignore Monad. Though it is interesting that she Oh, she's going to the bench. Okay. Does he go back to his office? 
is his office's bedroom. Or does he live someplace else? He's going back to his office, isn't he? No, he's going up. Ah, up to where the the guard is guarding. Okay, so what's that room called? Is that his bedroom? Longson apartment. Okay, yeah. All right. Well, uh, did I learn anything? Maybe I'll talk to Yulian in the morning um, and see what he thinks. I don't think I drank the coffee for sleepiness. Has my speed worn off? No. <laughs> I'm still super speedy. Um, yeah, I'll talk to Yulian in the morning and see if he thinks the information that I gathered is of any use. I don't feel like I learned anything, but how else could I... What other spying could I really do? Because, like, that's what he does in the evening, at least. Maybe he does something else in the morning? I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll talk to Yulian tomorrow and see what he thinks, I think. Because I learned some interesting stuff, I guess. I wonder if I can sleep when I'm speedy. Or if it'll just act like... The other thing... Oh, yeah, too tired to run. Okay, I'm good. And I'm still speedy, even though I'm too tired. <laughs> Alright, well, that was a cool excursion. And I got some useful programming done during it. Let's take a nap. Actually, let me save the nap for next time, just in case there's any dreams or anything crazy. Alright, uh, see you next time, whenever that happens.